to Hollywood. This is how you turn it when you're getting in a nice subtle drag. Out here on the corner of Hollywood Boulevard with some bullshit. Get it together. Clip it in. Keep it tight. Keep it right. Ooh. Yes, Lord. Let me see. Oh, yeah. That's fish. That's the daytime. Modern hip hop. Bitch. Call me Lock Weefer for the post modern hip hop. Lock paper. What? Lock paper. What? What? Lock paper. What? Lock paper. What? What? I said bitch. I said bitch. Okay. All right. Here your girl is on Hollywood Boulevard. See this? These are all the stars. These are the stars on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. And I'm hoping they left one open for your girl. This is how you do it. First, you come out here in nice, simple daytime drag, looking for wigs and costumes. And the second thing you do, you stay diva. Hallelujah. And you don't do no horn and prostitute because there's a lot going on out here. We're going to keep it together. Let's see if they clock me. Call me La Quifa for the postmodern hip hop. Bitch. Call me La Quifa for the postmodern hip hop. La Quifa. What? La Quifa. for these costumes, I gotta get this hair, and we gotta get ready for this show tonight. Oh Lord, we're going to Home Depot. I need a fan blower for tonight. So, you know what? I'm gonna brave the beaten path, and I'm going to Home Depot in full high noon drag. Ooh, hallelujah. Oh yes, now listen. I don't just be walking around the streets of daytime Los Angeles, California, just in drag for no reason. I had to be in drag earlier for some photos, and I have a show coming up very soon. So I'm like, well, why wash your face? Just stay up in. But for tonight's show, I've got to have a super sickening power fan for Beyonce fish. You know, Beyonce don't go to different places but a fan and maternity medicine. So. Now here I am at Home Depot, the home of all the men, muscular trade, and I'm a fearless bitch. You know what, well, they ain't gonna fuck with La Cueva. Come on, we going to Home Depot, bitch. I know, a lot of men look at me like I'm a prostitute, and usually I'm comfortable with that. But not today. Here. Oh, I would have to be in my whole clothes. Oh, let's go. We have a meeting. I'm actually the spokesperson for uh, Home Depot. They call me the Depot. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh, thank you. Where is the... Okay. Well, Roger, it don't look so obvious. <laughs> Lord have mercy. They got a film in here. I'm trying to be discreet. I just need wire. Where is that? I can't tell y'all what the wire is for. 13. Here we go. Rope and chain. Oh Lord. You know I saw a movie like this once with Jodie Foster. She didn't keep her virginity. It wasn't right. And they wouldn't. And of course I'd be on the screws aisle. That's rude. That's the inner laquee for me. Oh. The screws, screws, screws all down the side. Now where is the wire? Oh here it is. All right, victory is mine. Okay, listen. We have found the wire. We're getting ready for the show tonight. We're going to turn it. Let's get out of Home Depot before you know. They try to make me the real spokes model up in here. And I don't want to be laying on no kitchen doors trying to stay on no kitchen stuff. Oh, I hear planks falling. Oh, Lord, it's a hurricane Irene. Come on, let's go. Can I have any available associate tools to our 11, please, for customer assistance? Thank you. That's us. They're kicking us out. <laughs> I call security and say there's a woman walking around with gigantic Diana Ross. So they think Diana Ross is off of meds and she done showed up at Home Depot. Come on, me on security, girl. Look at that highlight. That nose is highlighted down. <laughs> the only nose highlight. Girl, this heat done got me Thanks together, too. Oh, we got in trouble. Yay, we made it to Hollywood. Right next to Marilyn, George Clooney, Elvis, and Jane. Work, Jane. Oh,